Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Versini. Sorry, I've been MIA for two weeks. I have no excuses. This is Michaela, so my friend. Hi everyone. <laughs> We're gonna be doing a get ready with us. Um, I've known Michaela for how long now? At least be. five years. Yeah. At least five years. And Michaela is actually in school to be a. I'm going to cosmetology school right now, so um, hair. Kind of makeup, not really, but I've always been into it, so that's what we bond over. Um, we don't really have any basis as far as looks and what we want to be doing. I'm going to be playing around with the Aphrodite palette by um, Shop Hush or Bad Habit. <clears throat> and I'm going to be using the Soft Glam from Anastasia. I've actually never played with this, so I'm really excited to try it. Yeah, I've, I've done obviously a couple videos on it. And really yeah, I've seen yours. Like it too. Yeah, I Do you have the Modern Renaissance? Yeah. Yes, yeah, exactly the same formula. Yeah. So if you love the Modern Renaissance, you're going to love that palette. That's what I use every day, so. Yeah. Um, okay. I already have my brows done. I don't do my brows because I'm not a beauty guru. And She's going to do her brows on my channel. <laughs> You're going to sabotage my look. No, he's bitch. coming for my gig. You're looking a little bit dry, so here's some moisturizer. <laughs> so he's coming for my fucking gig now. Very impressed, Michaela. You seem to be doing very well behind the camera. Thank or you. Or in front of the camera. Well, you know, <clears throat> shameless plug. I did theater and everything in high school and dance, so I'm like definitely used to like talking in front of people I guess and I just never shut the fuck up so can you swear? You can swear bitch I know I'm not getting monetized I'm just a small ass YouTuber. I just got the new um NARS foundation and I'm kind of living for it so this is what I've been using every day. I want to see how this looks in action because I'm you never tried it before right? I've never tried it no and I was I wanted to try it but like She's too pacey for me. Yeah, it's definitely, well, okay, first of all, um, serving me any anyway because I never use my color. That's fine. That's, that's pretty. I think it matches. It's like, just the, maybe the undertone? I think it matches my skin, like my neck, better than my face. I feel like my face is always really pasty. But what I like about it, honestly, I feel like you'd like it because it's really, like, it's called, like, the fuck is it called? Natural Radiant Longwear. Mm -hmm. But it's really, like, light in mm -hmm. consistency, but you can build it up. I'm still buffing away at my face because I don't know why your beauty mother is sucking up all my product. I'm sorry, bitch. It's fake. <gasps> it's real, bitch? Oh, I don't fuck with fake beauty I'm like, why are you giving me a fake beauty sponge? Don't be starting any rumors, girl. <laughs> can we play with um, any of the Shop Hush palettes? No, but I've watched reviews on them. Did you watch on every bitch? Yes, of course I did. Better have. He will literally text me when he uploads a video and just like send me the link and I'm like I have your notifications. I'm like, bitch, I have your notifications turned on. What do you I think no I fake am? Fan. A fake ass friend? Like no. Last time you uploaded something, mm -hmm. I think I was at my boyfriend's house. And he like um, he's met you before. Yeah. And he was just like, Is that Rossini? I was like, Yeah. Then we watched it together. Oh love goals. And he was like I ain't got nobody to watch my videos with. Living. Well. I'm gonna do some concealer. I don't know if this is gonna be. Your shade. I don't think this is my shade. I don't think either of these are really. Your shade. Gonna work for me, but we're gonna make it work, beach. I think the tart one is at least a little bit better than the ColourPop one. The ColourPop one is just too peachy. I'm not a peachy type of bitch. You are. You are very yellow toned. Yeah. I'm not using college words here. Neither of us even graduated. Did you even go to college? Yeah. You did? I didn't know that. Yeah, but I dropped out. I dropped out too. Oopsie. Yeah, I just went to um, community college. I went to a state school, so. Where did you go? I remember Wait, you yeah. going, yeah. I remember yeah. you going and then. Not liking it. Not liking it. Yeah, college was not my thing. And I... that's totally fine. No, honestly. Don't let people tell you what you should and shouldn't be doing with your life because at the end of the day it's your fucking life. You're the one who's gonna have to make your own living. And like if you're not gonna be happy going to college, don't fucking go to college. There's like to you can fire. pick up well like honestly you honestly, can pick up a know. trade, like you can you can do something like makeup and like do it on the side and do bridal work or like you can do makeup on clients and stuff like Whatever you're passionate about, I feel like is what you should go for. Because yeah. I think that it's like, 
so pushed on everybody that college is like so necessary. Honestly, it's not. I don't think so. I think that there are so many people in the world that have made so much money for themselves and a name for themselves that haven't got a degree. Yeah. I just don't think it's necessary. When I was younger, I just thought like, oh, I have to go to college, I have to do this, I have to do that. So I get it. I 100% get it. Yeah. Um, no, definitely. If there's people that are watching that are just younger or in high school, um, I'm not, we're not saying don't go to school. If you want to go to school and you think that's your path, then by all means. I mean, there are go. plenty of things that like, obviously if your dream is to be like a doctor or a lawyer, yeah, you have to go to college, obviously. But if you don't know what you want to do, I think another thing too, it's totally fine to like take a year off. Yeah, or, or, two, or two years or like, like, say you are really discouraged about not getting to the right school, go to community school. First of all, you save so much money yeah. and you can just transfer your first year or second year or just in between your um, first year. And you don't really miss out on a lot. Honestly, your first couple of years of college anyways are just core classes. Like you're just oh. taking English, math, like whatever. That's why I went to community college because the school that was like my top choice was UMass Amherst. Mm -hmm. And I got waitlisted. And the way that it works is that if you get waitlisted, then you're automatically accepted in the spring semester. Oh wow. Yeah, which I didn't know. But when I found that out, I was like, oh, okay. So it's my dream to go there. I wanted, when I went to school, fun fact, I went for political science. I wanted to be a lawyer. Oh my God, you still want to be a lawyer? No. Because I realized that I wanted to be a lawyer because I thought that that's like what was going to make me money and I wanted to make money and that's what I cared about. Oh, uh, okay. All I cared about was like having a life where like when I was older and I had kids and stuff and like a husband and whatever that I would like have a shit ton of money. Which is still obviously like a goal to have money and be able to support myself and like anybody else. Mm -hmm. But. Like, I, I want to do it now with doing something that I love. And like, I love doing hair, even just, even because I'm just in school. Mm -hmm. Like, I love doing it. So I would rather not be at like a four year school and just like, oops, be living and like doing what I want to do. 100%. Yeah, you also also only have one life to live, so. Exactly. Honestly. So this is like a dupe for like a um, who to be palette. And I know people are thinking like um, they work really hard on their um, formulations. They work really hard on their um, products and things like that. For some reason it's just stupid. It's kind of annoying. I totally get it. I totally understand if I was a brand, I wouldn't like that. Um, but if you guys are in the market for something that um, compares to that and you don't have the $65, to spend, this is a really good palette for the money. When I used to work at Sephora, I had someone come in and she was somebody that I knew and she wanted to try makeup and I did like a makeup like seminar with her and she spent like $300 worth of makeup um, because she loved how she looked but then if you don't practice and if you don't try it, like it's just kind of money down the drain. Yeah, I think it and she can be a messaged me like a couple months later being like, I love the makeup that you did but I spent so much money and I never used the makeup but thank you so much and it's like, it's important to always like if you're going to invest, just like practice. Because make comes out at the end of the day, and if you don't like the way, say you want to practice a wing, I still don't know how to really do wings on myself, let alone other people. I yeah. practice like when I'm just watching TV, and I'm like, this side looks good, this side always looks really good, and then the side is like wonky. It's always hard on the opposite. So I always practice on this side, and, like that looks like shit. I just take it off and then just start again the next day. That's the thing. At the end of the day, like people can get upset. But makeup comes off if it if washes off. Like, it's that easy. You do it, you don't like it, you're like, oh, okay, this didn't come out exactly how I wanted it to. That's totally fine. <gasps> Would you just do? Oh my god. This black on it, I thought it was something else. Uh, damn it. Oh, that looks like shit. Ah! I'm trying really hard not to laugh at you, but I can't. Okay, hold on. This battery is gonna die. I need to fix my fucking eye. We'll be right back. Oh my god, I just realized I never put my highlight on because we wanted to do my impression. Your reaction to the highlight uh -huh. on camera, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna do it right now. Okay. Do you usually record like by yourself? Um, yeah, either by myself or if I have like people that are here. I was like, do you want to film a video with me? You guys. Oh my god, look at it in the video too. That. And I and like people were scared because they thought it wasn't gonna work on like every like skin tone or 
wouldn't work on like letter compactors because it is a little bit gold, but it's really not though. That's uh, like it only has like a gold sheen. To yeah, it. yeah, yeah. My. I think I'm gonna let this this thing. Um, so I'm gonna let my battery try to charge, and we're gonna just do whatever off camera. Um, I made a mistake, and I just said we had we had glitter. That's just Here what we, are. we do, yeah. I did this eye off camera, and now I'm gonna try my best to recreate it. To um, recreate it. So we will see it when it goes, because no promises it's gonna look good, honey. Gotta add highlight. I'm not gonna go in with the Ombre Easy. I'm gonna go in with the Skin Frost by Jeffree Star in my Naomi Way clips. Oh my god, my daddy's. Yeah, daddy, is that what you're gonna do? Yeah, yeah. Fallout gives me nothing but stress and anxiety. That's why you do your eyes first, bitch. That's a bitch. I'm just not, like, first time. I'm so guilty of like getting stuck in a routine and just doing my routine. Yeah. While this hoe finishes. Ho. <laughs> I'm gonna set my face and I'm gonna put on a wig because my hair just oh, doesn't look good. Damn motherfucking so that's the final look. We look different because it was again an hour for you, for us, mm -hmm. and a second for you guys. Literally. I took the lashes off. The lash was just not happening. Not a lash. Not, not today. Not a lash. Not today. Mm -hmm. Um I I think it was this side the this side? There was black on the brush and I went to go smoke up my lower lash line and it just got everywhere Disastrous. so I'm like put glitter on it. Yeah. I have my hooker wig on. Glitter fixes everything. To be it honest. Goes Taylor, she has a hooker wig on. Yeah, this is my hooker <laughs> wig. Fake as fuck. Um yeah. That's not the wig that you. <gasps> oh my god. Oh it's maybe shady up in here. Maybe it's Maybelline, maybe she's fake. Um, no, I don't know. I had a lot of fun filming with Rossini. It was really like fun to sit down and talk and do our makeup. I usually don't like do anything like this. Like I'll sit down for like five minutes. Well, it's usually more than five minutes. But like I just do something super basic. So it was kind of fun to like challenge myself and do like this a look is like that my I version never, of basic. Yeah, I would never then... do this on myself. So it was cool to like have a bunch of different palettes to play with that I don't have at home. I got to try out the new. Um, on Razy Highlight, which was so fucking good. And then like the powder I tried, like I don't know, I got to try new stuff, which was really cool too. Hang out with some friends, have a good time. I had pizza, so I was all over it. Yeah. And you guys know that you guys can subscribe to my channel, or you have to subscribe to my channel because you're here watching this video. And if you don't subscribe, well, fuck you. Oh shit. The truth. If you ain't be being lame, lame. If you, subscribe literally. to uh, this channel before you leave. leave. And yeah, you should also tell us what you guys think of the final look. Yeah, I think it both they both came out pretty good. Um, I wish that I had a lash, but like I don't. It's okay. But it looks fine. But yeah. I'm thinking of like doing more collabs with Rossini, so leave down in the comment section below what else we should film. Look at this bitch running my channel, the foot. I'm just saying, um, leave it down in the comment section below. Um, he's gonna leave my social media link down below. Yeah, go follow her. Shameless plug. <laughs> follow, me. follow me. I don't even put pictures of myself or pictures of my boyfriend, but flower. He's hot. And yeah. See you guys later. Bye. Bye everyone! Bye! Peace. <laughs> Can we have a throttle? Oh. Uh, shout out to you, big daddy. Oh my god. Coming for your heart and soul. Oh. Thank you. I don't touch him. Bitches. Hey, bitch. I told Rosina we have to get Big Daddy on this channel. Andressa, close the door. Or shut up. Thank you.